It was expected to be an unaccompanied burial today at the Texas State Veterans Cemetery, but as KTEX's reporter Copeland Welch tells us, his family showed up along with many others to honor this veteran. The community came together to honor Private First Class Bob Gilbert Wood at what was expected to be an unaccompanied burial. That was until Wood's niece got an email on Saturday from a retired service member letting her know her uncle had died and she knew she had to take action. I immediately responded because we all loved Uncle Bobby. He was a wonderful person and a great uncle. My brother Jay is here with me um, and as well my brother-in-law Randy just to pay our respects and on behalf of the whole family it's just it's amazing. I can't, it's just beautiful the way the community pulled together and I know it would make everyone so happy. Wood served in the United States Marine Corps from June 29, 1960 to January 6, 1965. Wood also received the Marine Corps Expeditionary Medal for his service. I'm overwhelmed, literally I have no words. Um, I just don't have any words for all the, all the people and um, pomp, circumstance, and it was like he was a celebrity. You know, we're just so honored. Um, that we were able to be here. Roger Brown says the West Texas Patriot Guard Riders are sure to make an appearance at every unaccompanied burial, and this one was no exception. It's wonderful. Abilene is a wonderful, wonderful city that shows up when they have somebody like this. They come out in force. We've had as many as 500 people come out. I mean, it, it's great to show everybody that no soldier goes by the same. Wood was born October 2, 1941, and has been laid to rest at the Texas State Veterans Cemetery in Abilene. Copeland Welch, KTexas News.